Yeah. Now they're filming you eating the cake, you know, after the game flash rolls again. Stop, Very no, cool. yeah, don't put it. If we lose, <laughs> don't put it, we lose, please. Because they will play me for eating a cake before the game or something. <laughs> they, will fight, they will like match my performance with the cake. <laughs> yeah. I think you should. But it's a pretty big cake, yeah, because I'm not gonna lie. Like, it's pretty big, yeah. Mm. My cheese cake is so much better, actually. Anyone else to try? Mm -hmm. uh, it's really yeah. soup to eat that no, before thanks. the game, so I'll eat it. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I, for the record, I would never eat a cake before the game. I don't know why this guy does it, but if he ends today, that's why. Yeah, <laughs> cake. if he ends today, uh, yeah, it's yeah, because of cake, okay? Just please, like... Just for the You guys can make try the board already. Just betray me, guys. Hello guys, I'm Sakre, I'm a G2 substitute top laner and I've been with the team for the past year. The whole experience has been very amazing obviously, like just being able to travel which not a lot of people get to travel. But like in general, not like just Korea or like going to America, like the whole team environment is like really helpful to be in. My job is basically being here as a backup player but I still take things very seriously. I practice every day and like obviously try to, like it's not more about me helping the team, even though I try to like be helpful whenever possible, but I feel like this is more of a learning experience for me than me being like somewhat helpful to the team. Like I'm just there trying to be supportive and try to like help out as much as they need me or as much as I can. Think about the cover of the game. Just here. Take it easy, breathe in without. Think it's funny or? A lot of the teams really want like full, full hair and makeup. But do they ask for it? Or? Yes. I mean, I am also. See, some people actually care about their appearance, unlike EU and NA. Yeah, exactly, right? I mean, getting makeup is already a bit weird. I mean, before I joined the LCS at least, you know, first time I had makeup, it was like, why are they putting make makeup on my face? Just be glad they don't do lipstick or eyeliner. Oh, okay, so they don't do that. But if I put like the thing that makes my lips not so dry, it actually looks, they, they look really bright red and people think I have a lipstick. Well, I feel like me being the star player or like kind of transitioning into a more uh, influential player, player on the team is uh, is of course a, a good feeling for me because I mean there's a lot of spotlight on me but at the same time there's also a lot more pressure that I have to have to play good uh, time after time and like a lot of games in a row uh, but still we have different strategies so I don't even though we play a lot of carries compared to tanks right now and the meta is like kind of good for that or like kind of benefits me a lot uh, we still have strategies where uh, and I don't have to do like that much and I can let the other team shine, which I think we all are good players, so we should all be able to, to carry the game on our own. Our next matchup, though, is between G2 Esports and the Flash Wolves, with the EU representatives looking to bounce back after the loss to Bangu Buffalo. All right, well, the delay on stage has been resolved, so we're going to toss it Let's back go. over to the casters here to dive into our second game of the day. As you're going to see, Yankos go in, looking to make the move onto that enemy jungler. Now finding a lot of damage onto Mujin, who goes over the wall, only to be picked up by Perks. Good job there from G2. Ooh, a casualty in the bot lane. Oh, here we go, going right after the Braum. Not worried about the Zaya, recognizing she's able to get away. Yankos going into the stasis. Sword Art's going to be taken down. Yarnin grabbing the first kill with Did. Trying to gobble up his jungler, keep him safe. Heroic entrance coming in. 
Flash Wolves can't find anybody in return. They've lost their support for nothing. From the Inspiration Mastery, bottom side, here comes the dive. Nocturne going in, Yanko's looking to make this one happen. Out he goes, but he's stopped by the Hextech Ultimatum. Kill picked up by G2. Taking the Baron down now to about one-third HP. Hanabi still trying to run interference. Yankos wants to go in. If he steals this away, it's going to be massive. Red Team has slain Baron Nasher, secured by the Flash Wolves. But down. at what cost? Wonders taking down the base. He's on to Nexus turret number two. He's got the cannon minions. G2 just needs to stop the back. Hanabi's made it back into the base. But Wonder flashes to the side. He'll be controlled, but never killed. And G2 find their win. Wonder with the back door for G2 Esports. They do not care about the Baron. The split push proves successful. G2, two and one in the group. I felt like we played our con well, and the way we drafted for sure was good, um, against them at least. Uh, that's how we feel, and uh, we did pull over come correctly kind of throughout the game. But I felt like they could have forced a little bit more, but also Wunder was like on point with his split push, and we kind of knew what is our win condition, and that's why we played that way, and that's why the game was like, you, you could call it boring, because there was not a lot happening in the game, but uh, we did end it. I just feel like I'd have stolen the Nash, and then the game was like for sure won, but since I didn't, um, you know, we had to count on Wunder to end the game, and he did, so we won, and I'm very really happy. You know, you know, you know, there was one point when I had I in, I wanted that, that item, I was like, I didn't want to punish him, and he's like, yeah, 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 I have ulti, you can just go, and then I walked up. He's like, not now, not now! I was like, what is that?! <laughs> so I, I, I was just so triggered, because he had like no items, and I was yes, like, yes. I was like, okay, I, I will just punish him, you like, know? Like, Gertaka, yeah. uh, right now we should go mid now, uh, yeah, uh, yeah. let Jean uh, auto attack, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah, go walk up. No, 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 like, no, no. Like, silence mid, silence mid, silence not showing, silence not showing. <laughs> maybe you shouldn't go up right now. <laughs> and, and, maybe and, not right now, and, not right now. And I was like, but it, maybe you should flash. <laughs> yeah, yeah, flash, flash. Then, I was like, it's fine, we have still some flash, we have still some flash. <laughs> it was so fucking yeah, random. Yeah, it was really funny. Yeah. yeah, it was really random. It was like the most action I had in the whole game. Yeah. I got half of what I owe them. <laughs> Wonder and Perks ordered really with crazy. English really smooth. No, but you were, you were next to them but and you were saying stuff. No, you... Okay, Yankos. you're lying. I just shut up. I'm eating my ass, you know. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I think that after the game against the Vietnamese team Buffalo, I felt like the day after we were like kind of tired because we didn't have a free day and we would scream until like 2 a.m. So everyone's like a little bit burned out. That's why our screams that day were not that good. And um, you know, we were we are obviously a little bit tired from the fact that we have been here for like almost one month now and uh, we didn't have a lot of free days. We are always trying to improve, always trying to practice. So maybe maybe a little bit we are tired but also we are really hungry to be here and we are really hungry to win and we want to show europe and even show the west and they as well included that you know the western teams are a force to be reckoned with um, we are just trying to our best to improve and kind of we don't care as much about like being you know having a free day and relaxing we care only about how what we can do to actually become better and what we can do to actually win the next game 